one day today, which means I have less than nine weeks until my due date, and that is insane. Definitely in the countdown now, and I am just so ready. Symptoms this week, my stomach has been getting really itchy, I've noticed, and I'm hoping that I'm not gonna get any more stretch marks. I don't know like where I could possibly get any more. A lot of people look at my stomach and they think that I don't have any stretch marks, and I have a crap ton. I think it's just because they're old and they're all like faded now, but my stomach is literally like one massive stretch mark. It's terrible. I have been noticing, I'll just like find myself scratching my stomach, and I'm like, stop it, Jessica, don't do that. I've also been noticing I have been having a lot of Braxton Hicks contractions. It seems Seems like every time I make a sudden movement, like if I move too quickly, I get a contraction. Or if I get up too fast, I get a contraction. Or if I like move to the side, I get a contraction. There's obviously no like consistency in it, but I've just been noticing like if I am too active, or not even too active, if I just like change positions, I get a Braxtonix contraction. And oh my god, this week I have been noticing how I walk. <laughs> With any other pregnancy I've ever had, I've never felt like I had to waddle. And I am straight up hobbling side to side like an oompa loompa this pregnancy <laughs> I not only waddle but I walk extremely slow I don't know if it's just like the position of the baby or something but something is just happening like this kid is just like low I don't know I'm not sure exactly what's happening but I've never waddled before in a pregnancy like I've never felt like until I was maybe actually like in labor I never remember like straight up I mean side to side gangster pregnancy swag waddle already at 31 weeks weeks I am waddling insanely how many times have I said the word waddle already so the other thing is varicose veins I've talked about these varicose veins throughout my entire pregnancy it's definitely been like the number one symptom of this pregnancy and I have never actually shown you guys so I'm not gonna like get up on this couch and try to like form get into a position where I can show you but I took a picture of my varicose veins and let me just warn you they are disgusting it is very 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 bad and you guys are gonna like all freak out and then you'll see like I'm not exaggerating about these varicose veins at all but you know what this is just the ugly of pregnancy pregnancy is not always beautiful like people make it out to be and it, it's a beautiful concept and you make a beautiful child but the process is freaking ugly so I'm gonna go ahead and insert a picture for you guys this is a picture that I took a couple weeks ago and you can see that there is not one varicose vein on my right leg it is all on my left leg and they are terrible if I don't wear my compression stockings this is what it looks like all the time which is why I try to not go out in public wearing shorts because people will be like your leg is falling off I feel like since I hit 30 weeks they really haven't been getting worse but I mean how much worse can that really get <laughs> I think every vein in my leg is already protruding so <laughs> I had a midwife appointment last weekend actually on Saturday it was supposed to be on Friday but she had to attend a birth so we moved it to Saturday and that went great there's nothing really different baby is measuring exactly as far along as I'm sh should be measuring um she's not worried at all about the baby the baby being posterior she said that at 30 weeks 31 weeks the baby's position right now is completely irrelevant to labor so like later on in pregnancy we can maybe worry about that but as of right now she's not worried about it at all so that makes me feel much better because I'm like so stressing out about this baby being posterior and having like a miserable freaking labor <laughs> but I know it's still so early and it's still so you can't make those kinds of judgment calls this early you know Caden was head down the day before he was born and then the day I was in labor he was breached so he just like foot flop babies just turn like that they turn all the time baby is definitely head down still though it's kind of stayed in the same position for the last few weeks its back goes along the right side of my belly and then the head is down here and the little feet and everything are all up there <laughs> yeah that appointment went just fine nothing really new happened there um, my weight gain I don't know if I've talked about that in a few weeks but I weigh 166 now I started at 150 which means I've gained about 16 pounds I've noticed these past couple weeks I've been gaining like two pounds a week so I called it I knew it was gonna happen the end of my pregnancy I'm just gonna like blow up like a freaking puff fish what are those things called blow fish puff like mrs. puff and spongebob you know you know what my kids watch so anyway I can't really think of much else to update on a lot of people have been asking me about how I'm gonna announce whether the baby is a boy or a girl and I'm gonna make like a whole video talking about that so wait for that video I think that's actually pretty much it so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my 31 week belly so here is with the shirt on Here's with the shirt up. Looks like I am right at 42 this week. 
So I grew, I think like a quarter of an inch. If you can see my stomach, it look, there's no like obvious red marks like people usually get with the stretch marks, but my whole stomach is already, if you look close enough, sorry. Pregnancy is not always beautiful, guys, but you can see this is like where my hernia is. So you can like tell how bad that is and like my muscle separation and stuff. And then you can see there's like little lines everywhere from stretch marks, so yeah. It's beautiful in its own way, that's for sure. I think that's pretty much it for this week, guys. Let me know if you guys have any questions and I will try to answer them in the comments below or in next week's video. And I have been trying to upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I got that suggestion and I really like that idea. So either every other day or every like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I'm like kind of feeling it out. I'm trying it out. So we'll see. <laughs> Maybe I'll like sometimes do bonus videos on the weekend or something. I don't know. That's kind of what I'm thinking. But like the every, every two days or like Monday, Wednesday, Friday is what I'm aiming for here. So that is it for this week's video, guys. Make sure you follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. I'll have those links down below and I will talk to you guys next week for week 32. Bye. He changes poop diapers. There's no wipes. There's wipes in there. <laughs> Tommy, I'm dead.